Hi guys. Today our featured channel is Georgia Constitution Media. Please follow the links in the description for the original full video and his channel and give him the credit he deserves. First place we'll check out on our little map where this nice little flag is is City Hall. Shouldn't be a problem in the world that says our first amendment. Right? You know, walk in, check out this beautiful building. This is the parking in the rear. And this is next to the first national bank. City Hall renovation 2021. Just re did it. So surely they're gonna let us walk around and check it out. Come on with me. Oh, I'm just looking around. Should be fine. I said should be fine. It should be fine. Just look around. You work here? Yes. Uh, what's your name? What's your name? I don't get my name out. I don't work for the public. I'm not a city employee. You understand? Okay. Anywho and how. Waynesboro is the bird capital of the world. Welcome to City Hall with a door slam. Bird dog capital of the world. That's what you get when you come to Waynesboro. Came back action. Hey, how are you? Can I help you? I didn't call you. No, you didn't. What's but your they name, number? My name is Corporal Christopher Harris. Corporal Harris. Mm -hmm. The ladies, this is a public building. You're more right. than welcome to, to, to film. However, the employees, they do have a right to, to not be on camera. That's not true, sir. That's not true at all. Sir, now. Can I get your supervisor if that's what you're telling me? I'm coming to pick up a FOIA request. Okay. Then that's, you can get your request and you can go. That's what I'm trying and, to do. And this is my supervisor right How here. are you, Mr. Um, all right. Mr. Pritchett? Pritchett. I don't want to misspell it. What was your name, badge number? Fleming. Okay. So we spent all this money on this public building. I wanted to come in and take pictures of it. And they called the police. welcome to do that. And they called the police to me to try to put me in a cage. That's what I don't understand. No, no, no. Nobody's, nobody's trying to put But you're you saying in I'm not allowed to film public employees mm -hmm. in the course of their duty. And while you're in here, yes, sir, you need to respect their privacy. If they tell you, you to you're stop. not the feelings police. You are the sir, law enforcement. Now, I'm going to ask you, do you have business here? Absolutely. Okay, then get your business done. I'm trying. Okay. They called y'all and y'all come interrupted me. Y'all are dismissed. That's called being dismissed. Have a good day. Can I please get that for you information? I'll be on my way. You good? Everything good? Yeah, we're good. Okay, yeah. after y'all, I'll follow y'all out. I never... Oh, we're good. Oh. We're good. Y'all gonna good. hang out in here? Stay here, so go ahead. Okay, all right. Did you explain to them I had a right to do this? They, they, we already explained. Okay. Okay. Fine, I, oh, that's what I want to hear. Thank you. There you go. I'll try to get out. I think you gotta got lock this in a little bit. Waynesboro, Georgia. That's the corporal. So we took the corporal. We took the sergeant. And the other deputy. They tell me everything was fine. So we'll get our information. We'll go down here to a little rabbit hole, fill everything out, take it back. Everything should be fine. I just don't understand. City Hall calls the police on. They're trying to get a FOIA request. Too hard for him to park in a handicap. I mean, to park in a regular spot. He's got to park there. If I did that. You know what would happen. Did you see them talking and trying to conspire something up?
How long have you been with Waynesboro? Almost two years. Oh, that, you like it? Yeah. Like it, don't you? Never been here. Well, maybe. No? Maybe. Where are you from? Oh, I don't answer questions like that. You understand? But I I like to just check out little small towns and okay. public buildings and go places I can go, pull public records and just, you know, stuff like that. Awesome, man. But it is a nice little town. And I read this just opened, so I wanted to check it out. Mm-hmm. Rebuilt. Have you ever been a police officer? No, I, I know. Okay. No. I was just wondering, because you never know. I mean, you right, might have right. been one before, no, you know no. what I mean? Yeah, no. So, we never know what kind of situation we're getting ourselves into. Right. Okay. Um, there, I, I don't know if you've done any research on a lot of the police officers that have been killed in on duty before. Oh, yeah. You I've, know, so I've seen that. just I mean, a couple weeks ago, there was somebody that went to a... Uh, a call where it, it was a check for well-being so basically somebody called and said hey i haven't talked to my wife in three weeks i have not seen her i don't know where she is well the officer showed up and started shooting through the door oh the dude started shooting through the door oh, so, so you never know i, I mean i'm not arguing out. that but i'm arguing once it's over y'all are still here i'm on the public sidewalk and I don't leave I'm to the. I'm just waiting for my sergeant. Yeah, I don't leave to the police leaves, and that's that's you know something. That's just something I've always done. I don't I don't get shooed out of businesses. Oh, you know, public property and public sidewalks. I just that's all. You know, like the other day, he he tried to demand my ID, and it, you know, it's not stopping ID state. I don't show ID unless I've broken a law. He knows that. But I read in the paper, which brings me here, that a deputy uh, arrested a guy for not showing his ID with one complaint. A gentleman pulled up, got a kid out of the car, let that guy go without checking his ID. Now, if anybody should have had the ID check, it should have been the guy attempting to kidnap a little girl, you know? And I was ID'd, asked for identification for holding a camera in a public building. It's just kind of ironic. And that's the stories I put out there to kind of show the difference and, you know, what happens. Yeah, and absolutely. So. I get it. I mean, I get it 100%, you know? Uh you still ain't give us a reason why why you're here sir. a FOIA request i'm pulling a FOIA request she told me i could scribble it down on a piece of paper i'm trying to pour the information her salary her name everybody's name in the building and i want to get a copy so of for, the for who? Who, are you, who are you getting it for for myself no no sir they can't they don't have to give you that information absolutely no they don't have to now but i can put in for it and then it goes and you know, of course yeah, i you gotta get have it in writing and then it gotta be notarized absolutely yes. that's yes. what i'm doing yes. i'm getting my first copy yeah I, I yeah like i said you can explain to him i've done this you know a lot you know and that's what i'm doing here it's public and, and it's the first amendment protected activity by the united states of america and there's also if someone asks you we law enforcement if we ask for your id you are obligated to give us that information not unless yes. i broke yes. the law we, know, we need to know who we're talking to we were called here right we, i didn't we call need you to know who we're talking to yes. i didn't call you no, not they you, but they did. They did. So, so we got the right to ask for you. You can ask, absolutely. But like I explained to her, I hadn't broken law and I had to give it. I don't carry an identification on me while I'm walking around cities because I don't break the law. That's the best way I explain it, Mr. Okay, Prince. so then that's why we ask you to leave because you're not cooperating and you're not giving us your name and information. I don't have to. Yes, you do. If yes, we you ask do. for the information, you got to give it to us. Who's your boss? If, so we law enforcement. My we, boss right there. Yeah, okay, well, let me come talk to him. He's the chief. Okay. I'm doing it for you, request. Protected by the United States of America. This is a camera. First Amendment allows me to be in here. Public property. I'm trying to do a for you information. Try to get some camera. You try to get some information. Maybe some documents, names, salaries. And they call the police to me. And this gentleman was telling me in Georgia, it's a stop in ID state. I had to identify if I hadn't broken any laws. Okay. Well, why why won't you identify yourself? I don't have because to. You got. Okay, why would I? Why okay, would I give my rights up? Listen, listen, okay, listen, sir. Listen to me. Okay, we got this. Is, like I said, this is a public building. Public building. But you're coming here and you're feminine. People don't know who you are, what you're feminine for. You got these ladies upset. They're nervous. The proper thing to be identify yourself. But this is Share a them. First Amendment audit. I understand you that. Understand you understand that? We know you got. That's your right. That's my right. But we're saying, but to make people feel comfortable. Be considerate. That's not my job. My Wait, job is to audit my, these to make sure they're doing what they're well, supposed to do. It's my job to make sure the citizens of Wayneboro is protected. Right. Right. And, and people come in with a camera. Nobody knows you. I walk right up what there and ask for a, a FOIA request, which that way I have to give my name to her. She would have handed it to me. I would have given my ID and I would have filed and got done what I needed to do and probably been on my way. That's the way to do things. We, we, we like and love working with the public. Right. But we also want the public What if everything was perfect in this world? It wouldn't well, be no crime. No, right. But well, guess what? We live in the imperfect. There are imperfect people living in a perfect Absolutely. world. Absolutely. So 
to make our job easier and to make your job easier, we just comply with each other. There's no harm in saying, okay, I am John Tom with so-and-so, so-and-so. This is not a court of law. We're not going to stand here all day going over. And okay, going well, over let me get my papers and I'll get follow y'all out. Okay, that'll be fine. Follow y'all out. You caught that part. Okay. I don't get sued out of a building. All right, thank you. There you go. All right. All right, I'm done. Wasn't that hard? Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you. You have a good day. All right. Happy y'all. I never walk out. You go ahead. I'll be here all day. Well, I, you go ahead. I'm here. I'm, oh, I'm, you're staying I'm here. here. I'm on a fish Okay, bin. you're fish right. bin. Well, I'll follow those out. That's fine. Have a good day. Hope you learned something. Thanks for watching, guys. And please take a moment to hit the subscribe button. We really appreciate it, and it helps our channel grow. Also, check out the links in the description to the full original video, and also the Georgia Constitution Media channel.